Hi, Charlie Houck, Fast Tip Friday from Growth Dynamics. How's everybody doing out there? Hey, look, um, we're right there. We're staring at right smack in the eye. It's halftime of 2023, June 30th, the end of the first six months. You should be starting to think about kind of a sports analogy. We're at halftime, we're, or if you're in a racetrack, we're halfway around the course. Are we on track or are we where we expected to be? Are we ahead of our game or our pace or are we behind? So June 30th is a great time to start thinking about how do I get where I want to be on December 31st of 2023? So pretty quick message here today. You've got to be able to assess and tell yourself the truth. Am I ahead of where I expected to be? Am I on track? Am I on budget? Is my business development funnel, is it full enough to launch me into the third and fourth quarters of this year and give me a running start to success or to keep the momentum, ride the waves that I built in the first half? Regardless of your circumstance, what are the halftime adjustments that you have to make? Do you need to prospect more? Do you need to expand and find more accounts? Do you need to add more business with your existing accounts? It's always 10 times easier to build with existing than go find new. What part of your game do you need to improve? Do you need to be a better decision collector? Do you need to be a better sales process manager? Do you need to be more compelling? Do you know how to separate yourself from the competition? Can you sell value and hold the margin that pays you more commission or increases your earnings? So whether you're ahead or behind, you've got to be able to take the time and be a coach for yourself or get a coach that can help you make the right halftime adjustments. And when you come out in the third quarter, know what your 30-day priorities are. Know what your 60-day priorities are. And know what your 90-day focus is so that your third quarter really is as powerful as it can be in its own, but sets you up for a really tremendous end of the year in the fourth quarter so you can ride out 2023 as strong as you can be and 2024 sets up to take off again for the next year of success. What do you have to change in your approach? What are the different ways you've got to think about your business? Who are the people that are really valuable to you? And who are the people that are really sucking the life out of you? You got to know the difference. It's halftime, people. Make the adjustments so you can win the game in the third and fourth quarters. Thanks for listening and paying attention. I wish you all a great 4th of July weekend. Hope all is well. Take care. Be ready to skyrocket in the rest of 2023. Growth Dynamics is here for you if you need us. Take care.